Peace and blessings, people. Peace and blessings. Assalamu alaikum. What it do? What it do, man? This is your boy Azakar, man, bringing you flame. You already know. Make sure you like, share, subscribe. Like, share, subscribe. Hit that notification bell. You be left in that loop every time you boy drop that flame to your device. It's going to be 450 degrees. You ain't going to be able to hold your phone, man. You're going to be dropping like it's hot. Like it's hot. Like it's hot. Shout out, to, shout out to the black YouTube out there, man. O'Shea, Du Jackson, Ticket TV, Carcino, Kwame Brown, The League Attorney, J.R. Wisdom, Mr. Palmer. Too raw for sports, too raw for TV. Hey, man, hey, the brothers be bringing that flame. Bringing that flame on the tube, I tell you. Well, I want to talk about this one particular matter. And I'm sure brothers and some sisters can elaborate on this particular subject, especially if they're out, out in the workforce, uh, in, in industrial industry, uh, warehousing, et cetera, you know. Well, they could be uh, office job too, you know. But it seemed like, let me, let me take a little break right quick and we're gonna cook on this. When I get back, let me take a little smoke break, please. Be right back. We right back at it. We right back at it. <laughs> like I said, brothers and sisters, I'm pretty sure. You're working in a place, a workplace, where you have a brother or a sister of your own. And they may have an upper position. Now, it's nothing wrong with having a, a manager or a supervisor or a lead uh, title. But it's when you take on egos and trauma and try to belittle your workers. Well, I find that to be true, especially in the black family. When we landed on the shores here in 1555, I was taught by the Honorable Elijah Muhammad. You know, we built this country, blood, sweat, and tears. And there was also a robbery amongst us all. You've seen Django. You've seen it. Um, two brothers going each, at each other. Mandingos going at it so they can get some trim later on in the day just fighting for uh, the master's approval. You know. But that is a way of breeding and that creates a trauma that is passed on generation to generation to generation. Now, let's go up to date. With all that being around, like I said, let's fast forward to now. Like I said, brother and sister, just imagine you in the workplace and you got one of your own that's in a lead position or supervisor position. And you notice they go extra harder on their own. Which could be a motivating tool, or could it not be? Maybe it's to keep, you know, brothers going right, so, you know, they can keep straight staying busy, or sisters staying busy, keeping them straight or firm. What are you letting everybody else do with it, nilly? You know what I'm saying? And it's just like, you know, brothers, I want the brothers and sisters to look at it like, man, hey, brothers, such and such, such and such, such, so is acting crazy when it comes to them folks, man. They be tap dancing and everything. Laughing at the jokes, but with us, man, they be more serious. Now, do y'all have that going on in y'all work spot? Or any work spot? It's it been happening at several work spots I'd have been at. Several. I'm sorry, sisters. When y'all get y'all positions amongst the man, and you know who the man is, it's the white man. That man who owns them corporations. Oh, y'all laugh and y'all bow down. Y'all submit because he's paying you. <laughs> oh, you know. You laugh at the non-funny jokes. 
the sexual manner you put up with it, and all that. But you go hard on your brother at the job. Hell, get him fired if he came down to it. Hey, I'm just saying, I'm just saying. You know. And you, I, I, you slick doing the other man's bidding. Putting people together, putting people together. And fighting amongst each other. Mm. That's how I be sometimes. Well, I got this this clip of, uh, of Phil Scott. Make sure y'all subscribe to Phil Scott. And he got counseling on here, man. <laughs> this counseling going hard on the pay, man. But it fit the subject we talking about, though. So I'm going to let this play. <laughs> and we going to cook off this, boy. This is a trip. This is a trip. Subscribe to the Phil Scott. Yeah, Phil Scott show. The Phil Scott show, man. Oh, man. He got some bangers, dude. He got some bangers for you. But this fit this subject, though. Real talk. We got them handkerchief head Negroes at the spot. I'm telling you. They in there. They in there hall at March. Refrain from, from referring to your colleagues. That's derogatory names. This is an appeal on me calling y'all handkerchief head Negroes. And so I'm going to talk about handkerchief head Negroes in the appeal. Win, lose, or draw. That's what this appeal is about. I call you and him a handkerchief head Negro. Now y'all don't want me to say handkerchief head Negro in the appeal. What do you want me to say? Mr. Murphy, handkerchief head Negro. Councilman Murphy, <laughs> handkerchief head Negro. Quincy Murphy, handkerchief head Negro. I know your name the whole time. Giving speeches. We're not going to be able to get no work done until we get him out of there. He's a disgrace. And you think I'm going to sit here and applaud you? You're a handkerchief head Negro. Ooh. Shoe foot, man. Shoe fit. Shoe fit. Man, goodness gracious, boy. That's hard. <laughs> hey, get your head big, bro. <laughs> but they be going hard, man, for the man at this job, though. Go hard. Brothers and sisters, don't they go hard? Man and female go hard when they got that position. They go bullhorn hard. I'm donkey. 
I'm gonna do it regardless. Yeah. Them 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 peoples. Them them peoples. This your boy Moose do me a favor. Like, share, and subscribe, like, share, and subscribe. Peace and bottle, have a great people.